All right, welcome back to Ron's Garage. Uh, not a, this is what I got done video today. Uh, more of, I got some more parts. Uh, so let me show you what I've got here. I've got uh, some fittings for the fuel pressure regulator, uh, which is yet to be ordered, but will be soon. Uh, a Speedo cable. The Speedo also is yet to be ordered, but will be soon. Uh, an ignition switch. So that I'm going to be using pretty soon. A couple a uh, set of uh, plug wire boots, header boots, for the distributor and plug wires that I still have to put on. Uh, I got a couple, a set of uh, LED brake and uh, tail lights and front turn signals. Uh, those will be figuring out pretty soon as well. The turn signals, uh, I figured out what I'm going to do is mount those right there under the headlights and the brake lights will go where brake lights always go in the back uh, what's here now is these original ones uh, but they're all eat up in the back the holes are weird so i'm going to put these there or maybe that way i'm not quite sure how they're supposed to go with the their teardrops so you know i don't know what the the going fad is but uh anyway they'll go on there uh, so so along with that uh you know i've got the gauge sets which are down there and the fuel gauge i got to put in and the, the sender i got to put in uh and a few other minor little things but I'm collecting electrical stuff so I can start running the electrical. I only need three things electrical for this car that I don't have yet. I don't have the radiator fan, uh, but I don't have the radiator yet either. So, but I can run a hot wire for that. Uh, horns, I got to get horns for it. Uh, they're on my Amazon list, so we'll get those pretty soon, but I can run a wire for that off a relay. And uh, the brake light switch, the hydraulic uh, pressure brake light switch, which I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but it's going to go on that fitting right there, which goes to the rear brake lights or rear brakes. So I'm just going to tap it in there. I can run a wire there and down there for that. So everything else I pretty much have. Uh, so I'll be working on that pretty soon. Uh, life keeps getting in the way. I wish I had the time that some guys have, uh, you know, to, to work on their car every day. I wish I did. Uh, but I think I'm pretty typical of guys that are doing this. You know, we work on them when we can and get things done when we can. So it is what it is, you know. Uh, but I've still got a, you can see the front of it out there in my $900 truck. This weekend, I've got to weld a couple patches on those frames, those frame, one on each side. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily be in a hurry to do that, but I've got to pull my fifth wheel camper home from the storage unit very soon. And I'm kind of afraid to do that without fixing that frame a little bit. I don't care what it looks like. It probably, that truck will probably never pull that camper again after that, but... Uh, I got to stiffen it up some. It's about an eight or 900 pound tongue weight that goes in the bed of that truck. And I'm just a little leery of uh, pulling that. It's only three miles or so, but I'm still just a little leery. You know, the hitch mounts on the frame uh, on both sides, one attachment forward and one attachment aft of the, 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 uh, the crack. So anyway, be playing with that this weekend. Uh, and then I'm, while I've got the car still up in the air, I'm going to make the, uh, the rear shock mounts and put those on. Uh, so that hopefully is this weekend that I can get the back of this car down and start wiring. So that's what's coming up. Uh, but you know, and of course I got to clean up a little bit, you know, like all of us get this way sometimes I think so. We will see. So anyway, I know it's short. I intended it to be short. Um, so I could just, you know, 
not necessarily give an update, but you know, just show off some new parts and uh, let you know I'm going to be getting getting some stuff done here pretty soon. So, with that, I hope everybody has a nice day. Y'all take care. Bye. And one more quick thing uh, for Dave at Scott's Garage. Uh, I had talked. I had said I was going to look for mirrors. Uh, I believe these are the period correct mirrors for Dave for our cars. Uh, I do not have a second set. I thought I did, but I don't. But they've got a clamp on them on the bottom that mounts just like that, and they can go. I've seen pictures of them just about anywhere. You know, they can go. You know, down here, you can put them up here. Uh, but that, I believe, is the period correct mirror. So I've got a set. I wish I had a second set. We'd figure out how to get it to you. But anyway. All right, guys. Thanks. Bye.